PVC pipe, bag of stuff to make a diffuser is Velcro and a shower curtain. I'm gonna make a de diffuser for a shoot because I don't want to buy one. But before I do that, I'm gonna go run because it's still sunny outside. It's pretty quick. Went to the hardware store. I got these PVC pipes, two packages of this Velcro, a couple of connector pieces, and this shower curtain. My goal is to assemble this into a seven foot by three foot frame, attach the Velcro to the shower curtain, which is gonna be cut to match this seven by three frame. And then I'll have built the diffuser. So, we're gonna see how that goes. Also, I think this was all like, it's like 35 bucks for all this stuff. You might be able to get it cheaper, especially if you don't live in New York City. These were originally 10 feet. Uh, so I bought two, bought two 10 foot poles, uh, cut them to three and a half um, and three. So I have two, three and a half pieces together to give me the seven. Uh, I did that so that I could break it down easier. So instead of carrying a seven foot pole, I can just connect it and carry two, three and a half foot poles. Tape so that I can know just what I'm building, put it together quickly, like which size is which. So the guy at the hardware store just used like a hacksaw or something. So you can see these are like a little kind of frayed, uh, but it's not a super big deal. Um, when I put it in, a little bit like flakes off, but ooh, Duh, I don't know if you can see there's a chandelier thing right here. I almost just took it out. It's PVC. It's gonna flex, um, but it's light. Now that that's done. I'm recording like a video oh, for the uh, team of me building it. No, it's okay. Do you want to say hi? That's <laughs> my roommate, Anna. I had to get the shower curtain measured correctly, cut, and then Velcro together um, to put onto the frame. Now that I'm thinking about it, what I should have done, but it would have required buying another piece of PVC, which I didn't want to do is instead of these middle connectors that connect it here, what I should have done is buy a T, like a T piece PVC, and connected these two, and then had a third piece across the center to create better stabilization, because this is like kind of wonky. Uh, but I, this is for a shoot tomorrow morning, and it'll have to do. This is six feet by six feet, and this is seven foot by three foot. I'm gonna have to cut some off and try to attach it to the bottom. Laid out. Now, gotta attach it with the Velcro. All right, I'm gonna see if I can cut this into like six pieces. Is it even still recording? Did it die? Hey oh, not dead. Red red very little left though. There it is. Alright. So it's done. Let's take a little let's take a little gander. Pretty uh pretty happy with how that turned out. And uh, good news is I could just buy more Velcro and those aren't my books. I don't want you to think they're my books. I mean, I have books, I like reading, but those aren't mine. Um, 
I could swip it, out, sw swip it out, that's not a word, swap it out. Switch and swap is what I tried to say at the same time, and I said swip. I can switch it out for um, a different shower curtain or some other like nice different piece of vinyl, plastic, whatever, to create different effects. But um, so it was 14 pieces of Velcro when it's all said and done. Um, Velcro at various points. Got another one, up to two in the corners, middle, two corners. Third and last time recording this because it cut off and the battery died and I swapped this one out, but this battery is almost dead. So seven foot by three foot, that's two 10 foot pieces of PVC pipe, two 10 foot pieces cut to seven and three. Take the seven, cut it in half again to three and a half. So that's four three and a half foot PVC pipes, two three foot PVC pipes, and then connected with four elbow joints and two mid pieces. If I did it again, I would take the mid middle section, the connector, and turn it into a T shape. Instead of just connecting the two, I'd have a T. Excuse me. Um, take that T shape and get another PVC pipe, and then have an, like a additional to run across the middle. So right now it's just like a rectangle but I would get a different one, swap that for a T, and run a bar all the way across to right there. Insert what this looks like in the shoot tomorrow here. <laughs> Didn't use it. It was really nice light, so I ended up not having to put it together. But uh, I have it now, so I can use it in the future, which is a plus. So... All right, well, I hope that worked out because uh, obviously I'm filming this before I actually shoot that, so hopefully it worked. Um, but yeah, thanks for sticking around. Grace and peace of Christ be with you, and I will see you when I see you.